Hey YouTube T9 here. Got a new product. Just got it in the mail. I've uh, been waiting for this actually for quite some time. I would say three weeks or so. Um, that is because this company is a great company and they make it when you order it actually. They make the product when you order it so it takes some time to, uh, to um, produce. Um, this is the HSGI uh, Show Grip Padded Belt and um, HSGI stands for High Speed Gear Incorporated and this is a great product they make one of the the best um, products um, especially for the military and for law enforcement um, yeah let's get right into this this little review um, give you guys a little close-up these belts are also referred to battle belt or war belts um, you might wonder, oh, what, what, what are you doing? Going, you going to war now? Or what? Uh, no, that's not it. that's not the case. Um, actually, the reason I purchased this type of belt is mainly for you know going to classes, um, taking your AR to some AR classes or um, going to the range. That is, um, like I'm gonna show you guys later. You can pretty much load this belt up with all the accessories that you need when going to the range. Um, a lot of people think about this belt and they think about the range, they think about um, a quick bug out belt, but you know, if you really think about it, what about that bump in the night? You hear a noise in your house, all you do, all you have, all you have on is your socks and your boxers. Um, you know, you can take this belt, pretty much just strap it around your waist real quick, and um, you got everything you need. You got your magazines, um, your ammunition your holster even something to think about all right so let's get let's give you guys a quick, quick close-up here um, this is a modular padded belt system it's um, fairly thin it's about 0.75 inches thick it's about four and a half inches tall and it, it really doesn't weigh much as you guys can see all these all the webbing that, uh, that lets uh, you attach multiple items via molly strap. It goes all around. It has three access points, one on each side for, you know, if you have a leg rig that you want to attach to it, a leg holster, thigh holster. Um, like I said, one on each side, um, one on the rear here. I can tell you guys that this fabric feels very solid. Um, this will last me a lifetime. I'm going to the inside here, and this is what HSGI is known for on their um, battle belts. It has this neoprene finish in here, which um, I don't know how to describe it. It's very comfortable. It's very soft, very soft, really padded, and it kind of it really sticks to you. Um, you know, just like a neoprene, like a diver suit, maybe, you know, it's the closest I can compare this to. Um, it's very comfortable. I'm not going to strap it around me. I didn't, I didn't adjust it yet for my fat gut. So, so, um, you guys have to wait with that. But, um, yeah, it has attachments for a harness right here. Now. You guys have probably have noticed already that there's a belt insert here, which does not come with the uh, sure padded belt. You have to order this extra from their website. It gives you an option right there when you order it, um, which is this is called the Cobra Riggers belt, which is it's an awesome solid belt and um, has this giant buckle that has a quick release. All you need to do is press these forward and pull out. And there you go. To connect again, just push it in. There you go. Very solid belt, a nice heavy duty D ring. Um, like I said, you gotta order this extra, but it was well worth. Well worth it. I can tell this is a very solid product. Okay? Um, like I said, you can at attach multiple things holsters, uh, magazine pouches especially for your AR-15 um, dumb pouches 
everything you really need when going to the range or when going to some classes like mentioned before. And with this belt I've ordered a couple items that I'm going to attach to this belt already and um, like I said before it's a magazine pouch and this one is actually called the uh, double decker taco pouch and um, as you guys can tell it kind of looks like a taco mm -hmm. and um, yeah it's called double decker obviously because it has the uh, the AR-15 magazine on the rear here and then it has a, a, a spot for a smaller handgun magazine or you name it you can put a tool in there it, it fits various different sizes because it does have these elastic bands that um, you know expand you can you can you know, put an AR-15 magazine in here um, you can AK-47 magazine you name it sky's the limit so to speak so what I'm going to do is uh, attach these to the belt and by the way these come actually with these malice straps attachments which are some, one of the, some of the best to attach any sort of molly to um, to a belt like that or to a backpack or that sort of thing um, they go right between well, right through the molly straps here and um, connect to the belt like such which takes some time to do so what I'm going to do is I'm obviously going to take, turn the camera off attach them to the belt and give you guys a little overview on that um, but yeah I'm pretty happy with these double decker um, these double decker magazine pouches and uh, they feel great uh, like I said you know they take different size magazines um, very modular and um, we'll go into that in just a little bit once I attach this to my belt I'll be right back alright here's the finished product I gotta tell you those Malice Speed Clips, they are great. They um, attach these pouches very tight to the belt, make it even a little bit rigid and solid. But wow, what a pain in the arse, so to speak. It took forever. It took about an hour, a little bit over an hour to get those on. My hands are just numb. I mean, it's such a pain to get that. Those guys woven through the fabric and through these molly attachments. And it's, it's a very tight fit, um, you know, but they work. Um, like I said, these magazine pouches ain't going nowhere. Anyways, this is the finished product right here. Um, got my, like I mentioned before, I got the handgun magazines right here. Uh, the AR-15 ones here. Uh, I still have plenty of real estate left to add different things to it. Um, of course, the other side right here will have my, um, we're probably going to have my holster, my firearm holster as a sidearm. Back here, I'm thinking of adding, well, you know what? Let's call this Project um, Battle Belt. And um, the more items I get, I'll flip the camera on and show you guys and keep you guys updated on what I'm gonna add to this belt. Either way, I think it's a great purchase. I finally have a great um, sort of load-bearing kind of belt um, for when I go to classes and training and you know, the, the shooting range. Um, with that being said, that was my quick, I don't know if this was a review really, just trying to show you guys um, this battle belt and um, Maybe give you guys an opinion. Maybe um, you guys were on the fence and getting one of these, and maybe I could have helped you decide here. I think it was a great purchase. With that being said, T9 signing out.